secret state. This is the front page of the Mail and Guardian, South Africa, 14 October 2011. Intelligence agencies routinely access citizens' private communications. Government has the capacity to see your text messages, hear your conversations, pinpoint your location, access your personal records and read your emails. I mean, this is in South Africa. We are far behind places like America. Imagine what they are able to do in America. So, the all-seeing eye of South Africa's law enforces. Fascinating. Now we have the exposure of things that's been going on all along. I mean, long before the ANC were here, there were already abilities to access information, and it was regularly done. This is all just part of governing, isn't it? Check out that your citizens remain in place. So... You have the microchip already. The only difference is that you have no control over what is being done with the microchip. It's all done in secret. By getting the real microchip, you will at least have some oversight and you'll be in a better position. The best microchip of all is the one God gave you. The DNA. With that, God can pinpoint your location, apparently. He can read all your messages. He can read your mind. He can hear your conversations. Check your heartbeat. He can give you diseases and take it away. He can decide who dies in your family and when. He's got all these powers. He's constantly watching you. That's according to the great believers, the followers of the great master of the universe, the creator, the ultimate power, the secret state of the universe, God in charge. Yes, this is the state of intelligence in South Africa. Imagine what it will be in other countries. And no, it will be better that in South Africa all this Occupy Wall Street and all that crap. Tea parties, you name all the crap of trying to apparently change the way things are going. You're too late. You have one door left open, one that's open, which is democracy. Democracy, and if that is pushed through standing together as one and equal, one can change things. If we don't, then we'll just suffer. It's okay. It's okay to suffer till you wake up. It's okay to live in an illusion and deny reality. Do your research. The message of destiny is scary because it is the truth. And the truth is always scary. Just as this point is, front page, secret state, it's scary. But we've explained these things all along. So those attacking destiny, there is only one reason why they are consistent, is that they are employed by the state. But they can't do anything because we are sticking to the rule of law at all times. Yes, we saw you coming. Join us at destiny, where we are the real citizens of earth working for what is best for all within the rule of law.